From being blacklisted by the Ghana music industry to becoming one of the most successful dancehall artists in Africa. That's right, Shatawali is rated as one of the best dancehall artists in Africa alongside the likes of Vibes Cartel, Movado, Bini Man and other dancehall legends. Charles Niyama Mensa Jr. is a Ghanaian reggae dancer artist born on the 17th October 1984. He's known by stage name Shatawali and was previously called Bandana. Some of his best singles are the likes of Dancer King, Malevu, On God, and Taking Over. He's also known for Ready from Beyonce's Black is King album, which also featured Major Lenza. A song Dancehall King earned him the Artist of the Year at the 2014 edition of the Vodafone Ghana Music Awards. Shatawali is also an actor who appeared in movies like Never See Never, The Trial of Shatawali, Shatter Lives, and he also bagged the role in the recently DMX inspired movie titled Dog Man. Yo, enough of the blame game, man. What happened to you? Now get out. What? Dada. I want the blood clutching in and get out of here, man. In a recent BBC interview, Shatawali expressed his regrets for not pursuing the career in law. He said, I'm considering becoming a lawyer in the future when he's financially ready. So that's right. Wally had a dream of becoming a lawyer. I like, if you got a long cock, make sure you put it in a use. Got the woman, them want it for you. So what makes Shatawali the beast he is today? Shatawali has been sabotaged countless times by the industry and has always found a way to get things done without the help of the industry. Unfairly treated by the VGMA awards which led to him dropping multiple diss records dedicated to them. Shatawali has always been misunderstood and he has always been seen as the villain of Ghana music industry. I know they kiss us, fuck all your favors, nobody bigger than God, Jehovah. You know, go be show me nothing. In 2019, popular Ghanaian reggae dancer artist Stoneboy, who is seen as Shatawali's biggest rival, won the reggae dancer artist of the year over Shatawali. Shatawali approached the stage to congratulate him, but it led to a brawl as his intentions were misinterpreted. Shatawali is also known for going back and forth with a lot of popular Ghanaian music heads and radio presenters due to how he was treated in the past by these people. Shatawali is currently focused on making music for his fans and music lovers and is currently working on an Afrobeat album. With the likes of Bankuli, a notable and popular music guru by his side, he hopes to deliver a proper and amazing album to his lovely fan. But we shall totally ever change his ways and stop going back and forth with these people though. I guess that's a question only Shatawali can answer. So that's it guys, hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed this video, kindly leave a comment down below, let me know who you would like to see me make a documentary on. Bless.